Hey folks, Randy with Wilmington Grill coming to you today from the Wilmington Grill patio. Hey listen, the holidays are just around the corner so we thought it would be a good idea to do a couple of instructional videos about how you could prepare meals for your family and friends coming over to, for the holidays on our Wilmington Grill. So let me tell you what we got going on here today. We got us a Boston butt set up on our Wilmington Grill Master. We're going to be cooking this Boston butt throughout the day and we're going to come back to you periodically to show you how it's done but before we get started on it let me tell you how we prepared to cook on this Wilmington Grill. First of all we we pulled the Boston butt out from the re refrigerator <clears throat> let it sit out for I don't know 30 minutes or so so that it would get to a little bit more uh, a little closer to room temperature. You don't want to put that Boston butt on the grill absolutely cold right out of the refrigerator. Let it normalize a little bit and then we've seasoned it to our liking. So now what we've used is just a little bit of salt and pepper, but you season it to your liking, of course. And then we're in the process of preheating our Wilmington grill. We're going to get that Wilmington grill down to about 275. So now, depending on the grill you have, if you've got a, a classic or a deluxe, you may want to cut one of those burners off, cut the other burner down to low, get it around 275. And we're going to be cooking today using some good hickory chips, some hickory smoke chips. So we've, we've soaked those chips for a little bit. We've lined the flame tray with a little layer of tin foil. Now what that's going to do for you, that's going to just make it a little easier for you to clean up when those chips burn up. All right? So preheated your grill. About 275 is where you want to be. Got your wood chips in there. We're going to let them smoke up our, our uh, Boston butt. And uh, we're ready to cook. Now we're going to come back to you in a few minutes and show you how we're progressing. So stay with us. Hey folks, all right, we're back with you now. We, we're about halfway through our cook, and let me just show you what we've got on this Boston butt. Looking good, looking good. Getting a lot of good smoke out of our chips there. You may need to watch those chips. You may have to add chips along the way. It just depends on how long you're cooking your Boston butt for. But what we're going to be doing now is we're going to start looking for the internal temperature. I don't know, somewhere around 180, 185-ish, right in there. Again, to your liking. But I uh, just wanted to show you about halfway through, we're progressing along nicely with this Boston butt here on our Wilmington Grill. Hey folks, we're back here on the patio at Wilmington Grill, and we're just about to finish this Boston butt up. We've been holding a temperature on our Wilmington Grill at about 275 now for some time, and what we've been doing is we've been checking the internal temperature on this Boston butt. I just want to show it to you, let you see what it looks like. Man, that Boston butt looks fantastic. We're about ready to pull this Boston butt off of here. We've been checking that temperature, and it's right where we need it to be. So uh, we're going to pull that Boston butt off and uh, enjoy some good meals here. Uh, so, hey, this holiday season, you're ready to cook uh, Boston butt on the uh, Willem to Grill for your family. Throw one of these guys on there and enjoy it. 